Well, in a few moments, we'll be going live to tonight's national nightly news. But before that, let's take a look at what's coming up later on tonight on Channel One. At seven o'clock, it's the semi-final of the quotation game. And it's a nail-biting quiz tonight as a team of nuclear physicists take on four old ladies from East Grinching. That's followed at 8pm by award-winning documentary series The Shape of Now, which tonight looks at the history of the knee-length sock and its importance during the great blackouts of 1871. Not one to miss. At 9pm, sit back and relax with multiple award-winning movie The Freedom of Being Colin, taking us all the way up to 11.15, where, as usual, Dr Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be grilling his guests in Incisors, and tonight sees a return for leading economist Katie Brightman. Finally, at midnight, it's the National Weather Report, before we say good night until tomorrow. But now, it's time to join Jeremy Donaldson for the National Nightly News. Let's take a look at what's in store tonight on Channel One. Kicking off our evening schedule is a retrospective of the best moments from Peter Clement's Just the Job, reminding us just how our new Prime Minister became so popular in the first place. Following that, at 9pm, Megan Wolfe sits down for an exclusive interview with former Prime Minister Jacob Hamilton Mann in Truth to Power, and she'll be asking him where it all went so horribly wrong. I'll certainly be tuning in for that. Finally tonight, at 10pm, it's a bit of escapism, with Lawrence Blunderclatch's acclaimed action movie, Bullet Man, taking us up to the National Weather Report and close down at a quarter past midnight. But before all that, it's time to go over to Jeremy Donaldson for tonight's National Nightly News. Before we join Jeremy and the team, there's just time for a brief look at what's coming up later tonight on Channel One. At 6.30, it's a brief history of sports board, where Patrick Bannon will be taking a look at the surprising rise of this spectacularly popular new sport. That's followed by a repeat of the live National Sports Board final at 7.30pm. And again at 8.15pm, 9pm and 9.45pm. At 10.30, it's a world premiere of Channel One's television adaptation of smash hit school's musical Hey! Friendship! a touching and relevant tale of a 13-year-old girl from a modern family trying to adapt to the horrors of life in the old school system. It's another chance to view the sports board final at 11.45 before the weather and close down at half past midnight. But first, it's time for the National Nightly News with Jeremy Donaldson and Megan Wolfe. Well, in a few moments, we'll be going live to the National Nightly News. But before that, let's take a look at what's coming up later on tonight and every night on Channel One. At seven o'clock, it's another episode of What's Wrong With This Picture? And tonight, a group of television executives will be trying to work out why there's a cock and balls on the cheek of the Mona Lisa. That's followed at 8pm by Azores winning documentary series, The Shape of Then, which tonight looks at the long forgotten phenomenon we used to call outside. At 9pm, sit back and relax with multiple award-winning movie Electric Fever Dream, starring Lawrence Blunderclatch as Helena Canterbury Boatshoe and vice versa. That brings us to 11.15 where, as usual, Dr Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be eating his guest in Incisors and tonight he's got a chubby traffic warden from Stainstable in his crosshairs. Finally, at midnight, it's the National Weather Report, as if that mattered. But now, it's time to join Jeremy Donaldson for the National Nightly News. In a few moments, one will be passing control of the airwaves to Graham Bannon for a wholesome televisual variety entertainment in aid of a heartwarming cause. Prior to this, however, Channel One wishes to keep you elucidated as to our further programming this evening. At eight o'clock, we are very proud to present a performance by Jerry Mumpton's Circus of the Extraordinary, which, on this occasion, features appearances by a lady with some hair on her upper lip, a man with no hair on his head at all, and a child with a particularly long middle finger. One certainly wouldn't wish to overlook that. At nine o'clock, we present Existential Musings, as the Right Reverend David Atkinson and Lady Scientist Dr. Edith Blimey debate the existence of an afterlife in... A discussion programme with the Right Reverend David Atkinson and Lady Scientist Dr Edith Blimey. And finally, at 10.30pm, it's time for the National Anthem and for all fine, upstanding people to go to their separate bedrooms for unhealthy eight hours of unsullied sleep. But antecedent to these future attractions, one is delighted to hand over to national treasure Graham Bannon. 
Before we go over to the National Nightly News team, there's just time to catch up on our programming later tonight. At 6.30pm, it's What's My Old Tat Worth? And tonight, Frank Franklin and the team are in Granstable trying to flog an ottoman. At 7pm, it's today's highlights from the Sports Board Regionals, presented, as always, by Patrick Bannon. That's followed at 7.30pm by The Club, our harrowing soap opera about a group of poor young unfortunates who find themselves excluded from the Go-Getters programme and their inevitable demise. At 8pm, it's movie time, with the network premiere of smash hit Bullet Man 2. And after that, at 20 past 10, Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey returns with a new season of Incisors, and his very first guest is popular parrot Hamilton Scorkbox. At 11.30, it's a double bill for popular transatlantic comedy, That Nun's Got Guns. Before at 12.30, we reach the National Weather Report with Sally Peng to close out this evening's entertainment. But first, it's time to hand over to Jeremy, Megan and all the team at the National Nightly News. Well, in less than a minute, we'll be going live to the newsroom. But before that, let's take a quick peek at tonight's scorching lineup. At 6.30, Megan Wolfe is at the beach chatting with members of the general public for a special heatwave edition of Your Part of Town. That's followed at 7.30 by a double bill of movies as we show Alabama Jones and the Last of the Nazis, followed by its controversial sequel, Alabama Jones 2, whoops, looks like I missed a few, at 9.15. Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be chatting with a six-year-old chess prodigy at 11.30, before the weather and close down at just after midnight. But first, let's go over to Jeremy Donaldson for the National Nightly News. Well, before we join Megan Wolfe and the team for tonight's National Nightly News, there's just time to take a peek at what's coming up later tonight on Channel One. At 6.30, it's Ration Kitchen with Jordan Rankley. And tonight, he'll be screaming at some pensioners while they try and fashion a nutritious meal out of a can of condensed milk, a cow's tongue, and some rhubarb. Not one to miss. At 7pm, it's a look back to happier times with part 8 of our acclaimed documentary series, The First 365, which looks at the astonishing progress made by Advance as we begin what is only their second year in office. At 8.30pm, it's over to Patrick Bannon for all the day's sports board highlights, including all the tabletop action from the semi-finals of Pro Amateur Sports Board, the Sports Board Sports Board Game. At 9, it's our nightly war report from the late news team, followed at 9.25 by our unsettling play, When Katie Went Abroad, which tells the cautionary tale of one brave young lady's battles to survive the cruel administrations of our neighbours. At 11.25, it's incisors. And tonight, Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be getting his teeth into Fiona from Humble Bamblebury, who has invented a tasty twist on the Humble Biscuit. And that takes us, after the weather and public information film, into our close down. But first tonight, it's time to join Megan and the team for the National Nightly News. This is Channel One, broadcasting across the territories. Before we go over to join Megan Wolf and the team for the National Nightly News, there's just time to take a look at what's coming up later on tonight. At 6.30pm, it's Territory Trivia, where tonight a group of Menu Centre Fulfilment Executives from Territory 4 take on our reigning champions, the CCOs of Territory 11. After that, it's a special programme looking back at the life and career of Peter Clement. That's just a job at 7 o'clock. At 9pm, it's a chance to see the very first episode of Just the Job followed at 10pm by a chance to see the very last episode of Just the Job. At 10.45, Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be attempting to learn the xylophone in Incisors, and that's immediately followed by the latest episode of our travel log across the territories at 11.30, where tonight Jenny Demina will be looking at the old labour camps of the former Urkistan and how they've been converted into luxury holiday camps for the territory's family breaks. The Territory Weather Report takes us into the daily advance briefing before we spend the night showing you a series of random pages from Terratext, accompanied by offensively inoffensive music. But first, it's over to the newsroom for tonight's National Nightly News. Before tonight's edition of the NNN, there's just time for a look at what's coming up later tonight on Channel One. At 6.30, it's local programming with What's Traipsing Through Your Territory, At 7.30, it's movie time with, oh God, it's triplets, 
a harrowing drama about a family cursed with financial ruin and emotional collapse after the birth of their unexpectedly large family. At 9.15, it's What Music Is Best, a rundown of the top-selling songs across the territories. Expect catchy tunes and scenes of an inappropriately sexual nature, not one to miss. At 10pm, it's time for Julia's Diary, where the ever-popular Prime Minister reads extracts from her diary in front of a warm fire. Then, at 10.30, it's the latest episode of our drama series, Betterment, which tells the inspirational story of Emily Dennisworth and the brave doctors and technicians struggling to help her shed her old habits and adjust to the new future. Strong language and themes of selfishness there, so not one for the kids. In Sizes is at 11.15, and Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey will be looking back on Liberation Day by talking to several eyewitnesses and asking, how did it all go so right? That's followed by the Territory Weather Report, Advanced Briefing, and pages from Terrytext, now featuring up to 16 simultaneous colours. What a time to be alive. But first, time to put on your thinking glasses as we go over to Megan and the team at the NNN. Well, before we join Megan and the team for the nightly show, there's just time to catch up on what's coming up later tonight on One. At 6.30, it's time to go to Scritchford Square for tonight's episode of The Scritch. Expect depressed people not communicating properly and ending up in all kinds of no-co situations. At 7.30, it's movie time with the network television premiere of The Automated, last spring's smash hit movie from Lawrence Blunderclatch and the late Helena Canterbury Boatshoe. At 10.15, it's Julia Salisbury's Team Talk, which tonight is on the subject of Gorders and the evils of their creative accounting. At 11pm, it's Lil C's Lil Chats, and tonight the former singer is asking Dr. Adrian Atkinson Blimey what he's been up to since the cancellation of Incisors. Apparently, it's mainly jigsaws and arson. At midnight, it's the full territorial weather, fertility and birth report, and that's followed at 12.20 by the Clenfilinogoth Valley Male Voice Choir debuting their first professional performance of the new territorial anthem to bring tonight's programming to a suitably uplifting close. Soko. But now on one, it's time to hand over to Megan and the team for the nightly show. 